Hey, hey, everybody. Hello, hello. Uh, this time again, coming back with another video. Hope everybody's doing well. Uh, today I picked up an Amazfit GTS 2 Mini. I like the smaller size. Got small hands, as you know. So, uh, I want to give uh, Amazfit another try. Because I had a... Uh, a few months ago, I had the, um, the Amazfit uh, Band 5. Much, much smaller version. It's a, um, it's a fitness band. <clears throat> but this one is a, uh, a watch. Like, I really can't tell what the difference are, right? Uh, the watch is what they call a watch. Uh, your fitness band still has a uh, watch on there. So, I, I personally do not know the difference. Got my knife. Get this open from the back. Not the top. Looks like I damaged it. Boxed up very well. We got here your normal documentations. It's uh, oh, pretty big. Not a small little documentation. These uh, Amaze Fit now. Uh, has a pretty good reputation now, so you know they are selling quite a lot of the, the watches, and, and they function pretty well. Uh, I I did had uh, like I said I did had a uh, uh, Amazfit Band Five. It's a much smaller version. I'll put it up here, show you what that is. Uh, the reason why I, I actually I returned that that device. There was a an issue, and then there's some issues with me as well. Um, it's uh, it's too small. And uh, as you get older, uh, your eye kind of uh, start going out on you. And uh, I had a, you know, I had a hard time uh, seeing uh, the screen, uh, the time, and all that stuff. Uh, but it, it it functions. Uh, it functions okay. Now there there is a uh, issue with the with the band five, um, and the reason why I returned it is because the, I I go hiking at a usual location, and that place does not have any. Um, any any cellular signals uh, when you're in in the mountains. So what happened was uh, the the total length of the the total length of the hike uh, the area is uh, a round trip is about two point two point something miles a short hike, but the the uh, maze fit the the band five actually shows uh, consistently showing more than four miles that. I, I don't know why. Um, I have the uh, this guy, the Fitbit Charge Three. This thing is accurate in the in the GPS, so it's telling telling me it's two point something when I got down to the mountains. But the Amaze Fit uh, consistently uh, over multiple times, uh, it's showing me that it's uh, it's four miles, four point something miles. So that's why I return it. So uh, I got this Amaze Fit Mini. Let's look at the size of this. It's so small. So this is a watch. This is the green version. They have uh, three particular colors: the uh, the black, the pink, and the green. So I guess they make it a little more appealing for uh, different people. Uh, the band, to me right now, it, it looks very plasticky. It's very light. It's very light. It's very thin. Um, this screen is uh, 1.55 uh, inches. And I like the size because I, I am uh, a small guy. I have a small wrist, you know, small hands. So I wanted uh, something small. I don't want something to be too big. Now this thing, um, Amazfit says the the battery, the battery should last you uh, quite a long time. Um, they said general, general use, typical use will last you 14 days. Heavily, heavily used. Um, the battery is about seven days or so, but if you there's a basic use uh, 21 days, so that that's a lot that that really is a lot so um, there, There's a lot more to it to this guy um, There's a lot of a uh, uh, exercise feature in here uh, It says it's got uh, 21 No, not 21 seven 70 something 70 something uh, 
exercise uh, uh, activities. Me, I would probably just use less than three. And here's the here's the little charging. Uh, it gets his uh, magnetic. Get away around. Plug it in, and it lights up. So this UR code will um, let your phone download the app. And I'll, I'll download the app and show you how that how that is later. There we go. Photos. Zap. I downloaded this before and I created an account, but I removed it because I I returned the other the other uh, band five. Okay, so I got this guy logged in. So right now, what I I don't have anything here. Uh, I don't know if this will work enough. Uh, battery on here yet so let's uh, the watch location allow got it allow alright let's uh, scan the QR code again Set paired 10%. So let's give it time. Um, I'll go through the uh, the settings with you. Now this is the uh, this is the app here. Um, so you got the store. You can uh, change the uh, the face. I'll de definitely find out um, what's better later because I, I mainly want to see the. Um, the heart rates. I think this one, this one actually worked. Okay, so the update is done. On, I had to go through the whole list to see what I wanted to, what kind of alert I want to receive. Uh, everything else is on incoming call, <clears throat> vibration, app setting, fine watch, system update, just done that, we got profile, uh, my gold, again, Setting unit right here. We're on uh, Imperial, so the feet and miles and uh, pounds. Everybody else is on Matrix. But other than that, this is the the app. I mean, you get all your uh, settings here: your sleep goal, your heart rate. Uh, there's woman cycle in here that you can uh, set up. So uh, it's it's got quite a lot of data. Let's try this watch face again. Um, I was looking at uh, which one. Looking at this one. All right, so let's see what we got. We got almost 50%, a little less. That's the, the phase that I uploaded. You, you have multiple watch faces that you can actually uh, upload here and basically just holding this thing uh, and it goes to the, the watch faces and I actually I, I like one of these two uh, I got the heart rate so you know again this, this watch has a lot of the bells and whistles um, you know like I said it has just your heart rate uh, there's the uh, uh, SPO2, the oxygen. Uh, there's a pie. I, I, this is a, I believe it's a summary goal that um, AmazeFit uses. Uh, you know, if, if you keep it under like a certain 
uh, with a certain number, I have to look that up. Uh, it would say your uh, your your health is actually very good. Uh, music and all that connect. Uh, there's uh, the, of course, the uh, Amazon feature. I don't want to say the name because it will kick in my uh, my my device. But I don't see any use for it because the this device cannot talk back to you. So that's that. Now this thing also has a built-in uh, GPS. So that's why I wanted to try. Uh, the location where I go with the um, where I have issue with the band 5 it's giving me more <clears throat> it's giving me more of the, the distance than than it should be so yeah um, you know I, I will definitely want to try that uh, in regards to uh, activities you know you slide down there's your setting uh, slide up is the um, what you call it the uh, the notifications I don't have anything at the moment, so I made some. You know, there, there's the uh, all these um, <clears throat> all these features that you can have. There's quite a lot of feature: workout, heart rate. I just rearranged this. The, the heart workouts on top, SpO2. Um, there's a lot more down here where you can do. You know, the the music, weather, uh, compass, uh, find a phone, world clock, if you're if you're a traveler, yeah, this thing is, it's actually very, like I said, it, it's very comfortable. I, I like it. I like it. I really do. So the only thing I need to test out right now is to see if the uh, GPS is working. Um, otherwise, I, I am really liking this thing. So uh, It actually feels pretty good on the wrist and uh, kind of responsive. And there's the activities. I don't have anything right now. I'm going to take it out for a spin right now and see uh, if I can get some steps eighty two and the and this thing shows eighty four which is about which is about correct so this this guy is actually the Fitbit is pretty accurate um, but what I don't like about it and I'm, I'm having some issues with this already because Right now, uh, if I go out in bright daylight, this thing is getting very hard to see. Uh, this is my dirt replacement of this guy already. Oh, yes. The heart rate monitor here on this guy is not a continuous heart rate monitor. It's, it's a 24-hour monitor. But you have to set it on the app uh, on the interval. So right now, I have set it to one minute. I, I do wish that it is continuous. And sometimes, my heart rate is, gets a little bit uh, overblown. So I do want to, you know, the, the heart rate to be like this guy. I start counting every time um, nonstop. Um, but I do want to do one more thing, the SpO2. Uh, and let's see. Again, I'm getting 95, 97. Like I said, don't don't rely on these, you know, too much. If you are having uh, issues, uh, please please check with your uh, your 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 primary care doctor or uh, whoever your your medical uh, professionals. Okay, so uh, that's it's, these are just reference for you. So this is the park what I'm talking about where I have issues with the with the Maze Fit Band Five. Uh, there's no there's no cellular signal in here, so I'm getting uh, a misread on that device. So I'm gonna set this thing to uh, work out. Do outdoor walking, and this thing should have a GPS, so I don't need to rely on the GPS that is on the phone. Technically, right? Now, the other issue with the the band five is uh it doesn't track my track my route. So let's see if this will do it. Okay, let's go. I made it to the top. I'm getting 150 here at my heart rate. And let's see what I got on my Fitbit. Are you seeing this? 
a hundred on my Fitbit. I don't think this is uh, accurate, but 150 on my uh, on the new Amaze Fit seems to be pretty high. But I might give it to them in Amaze Fit because there was a there was one time uh, my doctor put a heart monitor on me and I was uh, I was hiking and they said uh, my heart rate was at up at 160 something so. That actually could be right. So taking a break a little bit. It comes down a whole bunch. Nice place here. Alright. I just got done. Uh, look at that. Heart rate 116. That's, look at that. It's pretty vivid. Uh, 2.14 now. That's more like it. Uh, 800 something calories. And uh, what's the what's the time frame? How come it didn't show up? Come on. Uh, 1.24 hours? Oh, okay. So, yeah, that's that. So, here's my... That's about uh, 2.31 mile uh, on this guy. It's a whole lot better. Uh, 1.23... Uh, Heart rate. Where's my heart rate? 113. So that's about right. So I'm gonna stop this guy here. Finish. So these are all the stats. So uh, now, how do I? Okay, gotta hold it to stop. And there you go. There's the uh, GPS distance. It's showing here. The stats. So here you got all the data that you need. Um, the walk, uh, 7,000 miles, the, the, I mean the steps, miles, huh? And uh, the, the heart rate, it went up to as high as uh, 160 something. The distance, it is mapping my location. So this is where I walk. I can't pronounce the name of that. So that that's... Um, where the hiking is and all these are tested earlier the s the spo2 uh, the oxygen so uh, calories burned the sleep uh, i haven't slept yet don't need to sleep i run on gasoline and this is the fitbit app uh, the yeah, this is the, the Fitbit uh, map. It's a little sharper on here, but it, it, it's still coming from Google Map. So, and so far so good. I am really digging this uh, device. Um, this is just my first impression of it. Um, the long-term uh, usability and uh, stability uh, will have to come after, uh, you know, I use it for a few weeks and see how reliable it is. I'll certainly come back and let you guys know, but... As far as uh, um, right now, um, it, it's working to the way I want it, except, you know, I really do want it a, uh, a continuous heart rate if I can. But it is what it is. Uh, you know, this is, um, what is it? Uh, I paid 80 something dollars. Uh, there is a, this is actually a hundred dollars, but at the time of this video, they were, they were running a, uh, Easter sale, 15% off, and I found another 5% coal, coupon code somewhere. So, hey, it's a deal. You can't compete with uh, these two, you know, the iWatch or the Samsung watch. They're at, you know, almost $400. But you are getting what you get. You can get everything that you need. 
a lot of exercise uh, activities in here, uh, more than really more than you need. Um, and it's a so-called watch, uh, you know, smart watch rather than a fitness tracker. But then again, you know, I mean, what really is the difference between a tracker and a uh, watch anyway? Besides, maybe it has a little more memory and uh, more exercise activities, right? It's still got a watch. You can tell time. The it, it's very vivid, uh, as, as you can see earlier on the uh, on the video there. Uh, in full daylight, you can see it very well. It's also it is waterproof. It's got um, you know the swimming uh, workout, but the heart rate will not work when uh, when you're swimming. So it's waterproof. You don't have to worry about getting the damage. Anyway, that's all I got for this video. If you like my video, please give me a like. And if you can, subscribe please. If you don't like it, it's okay. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.